we've always had at least one guy that we knew that guy goes out, um, you know, we've got a really good chance to win. Having two uh, right now is huge for the confidence of the whole team. Um, you know, again, they just know we score one or two runs, we've got a chance to win. If we make the plays defensively, uh, they're not going to give up many runs. So it's a nice feeling going out. It's a nice feeling for the coaching staff to know I can ride both of those guys in the lineup on game one and game two and feel like we've got a really good chance to win those games. Both of them are, are junior college guys. Uh, Ruben Renteria was at Odessa Junior College and um, Jamie was at McLennan Community College in Waco and you know they were guys that you know to be honest with you weren't getting a lot of innings and then we were able to kind of sneak Jamie out of there and he's been outstanding for us. Um, Ruben uh, pitched at Odessa but also got hurt and um, you know so he didn't get as many looks as he wanted and it would just seem to be a good fit for us so uh, and again he's come in and been the the first game on Saturday seven inning game and he just nails that one down uh, you know we feel like he's going to go six or seven every time out. I really didn't get to play a whole lot at McLennan, um, but I just tried to support the team as much as I could and had a couple friends who knew uh, Coach West and he called me up, uh, came down for a visit. I live just around the corner anyway, so um, academically there were a couple schools that were interested. Uh, but here, they offered me a position to play baseball, and I thought, you know, might as well finish out, play no another couple years, go to school, get a great education. Jamie's a guy uh, that works down in the zone. Uh, he's got a lot of movement on his pitches. He's very aggressive in the strike zone, and, you know, he's making guys put the ball in play, and we play really good defense behind him. Ruben, uh, I mean, his best pitch is his curveball. He can throw that at any, any pitch, any count, uh, any time in the ball game, and uh, it, it makes it tough for hitters uh, when you never know. It might be a 1-0, 2-0 count, and he can throw that curveball in there. Uh, so he's very effective at changing speeds, and then off that curveball, his fastball is sneaky fast. I mean, he's not a guy that's going to light up the radar gun, but he's, you know, he can 84, 85, but when you're throwing a lot of curveballs, that makes it seem like 87, 88, 89. So, um, you know, he's just very effective, can throw any pitch for strikes at any time. I feel my confidence is through the roof right now. I feel like I can't be hit. That's been the biggest confidence. And the confidence booster and the biggest part is the defense. Uh, I haven't been a part of a team like this one where I know I can leave a ball up and Josh Covey's going to go out and track it in the gap without a doubt. Or, Scruggs is going to knock one down at the third base line. He's going to throw it over. Return good double plays up the middle. It's just, and Barry produces with the bat. Um, I pitch without fear, really. Both of those guys are very confident in what they do. Um, you know, they're not afraid to give up a hit every once in a while. They know if they're around the zone, the defense is going to play behind them, but they're not going to pitch scared. They're going to go right at the hitters, and, uh, you know, we love guys that do that. Yeah, there's, there's always going to be pressure when you go out to the mound, but really you just have to try to handle it um, like you would handle anything else in life. It's something that in the back of my head I, I say and I think to myself, I'm the ace. And honestly, it pushes me to be better because whenever I go out there and I look at my teammates, I can tell they're very calm and relaxed. And I feel it's because they feel we're the aces. They feel, I, I look at them play when we pitch and they look so smooth out there. They're like no worries about it because me and Jamie are on the mound. But the more success you have, the more confidence you get and they feel like every time out they're going to give us a chance to win. I can tell you the team feels the same way. When those guys are on the mound, uh, you can just tell there's a, a difference uh, with kind of how we approach the game knowing that, hey, we score one or two or three runs, we're going to win this thing. Leaving Matthew Chalk as the only obstacle between Renteria and what is a near no hitter. That one slapped. Corbin on the move in left field. One pitch, one out. And the Comets win this one. They come back with eight runs in the fifth inning to finish this one off eight to one. And they were backed by a marvelous pitching performance by Ruben Renteria. Comes set, chest high, one two pitch, and a swing and a miss, and that will do her. That is the ball game. Fourth strikeout. For Murray in the ninth, one run off 
first complete game. Andriak goes six and zero. His first complete game of the season.